Welcome back to Fox 43 AM Live. Join us now is Trina Goss with Go Topeka. Talk to us this morning about the Education and Industry Summit happening July 25th. Good morning. Good morning. I'm very excited to chat about this a little bit. I love uh, kind of bringing in these uh, kind of uh, events and, and mm -hmm. speakers to kind of mm -hmm. help us grow the city, really. Yes. So to begin, you know, for our viewers, what is this summit all about? So this summit is really about bringing together um, educational partners, industry leaders, and just the community as a whole to learn more about how we can better support young people as they are growing into their future careers or future ec educational opportunities and um, just how we can create a a great supportive environment for them. Perfect, because yeah, I, I remember being younger and having no idea what I was doing. Still don't know what I'm doing, but I've kind of figured yeah. it out as I go. Yeah. So it's great that you give people a, a, a step up really there. Yes. And so I want to talk about some of the events. So the keynote speaker, uh, Mark Perna. Yes. Yes. Tell us a little bit about <coughs> Mark him. Mark is a generational expert, um, specifically um, focusing on Generation Z. So that's the group that's aged 10 to 27. Um, these are the kids that have grown up through COVID, um, having to go to school online, really needing to make a lot of adjustments. They're also highly um, technical, and they might be a whole lot smarter than we are mm -hmm. because they have. <laughs> sure. They have are constantly learning new things online. Um, but those of us that have been around for a while, you know, we might have kind of a negative view of that maybe we think they're entitled or they're lazy, but they're really not. Um, so Mark Perna really hones in on that, and um, he he wants to help uh, those of us that are leaders in the community to help these kids find their passion, their purpose, and productivity in their future. Mm -hmm. um, he's a weekly Forbes contributor on workforce and education. Um, just has a lot of great information to share and is very motivational as well. So. So, uh, wonderful, so yeah. cool. And now, so okay, you mentioned kind of talking about like the Gen Zers out there mm -hmm. and uh, it, the industry to kind of to help the younger generation. Uh, for people like me, a, a millennials, like will we be able to get something out of this event as well? Absolutely, yeah. So. Um, especially like working in the community, um, working with industry, uh we're going to hear from panels in the afternoon. We're going to hear from young people on what they hope to get from their community, what supports they feel they need, uh, maybe what's lacking, but also what's great, um, and their outlook for their future. Um, we're going to hear from youth program providers, those who work directly with kids outside of the school system, um, and things that they see happening you know, in, in family units, and then also from industry leaders themselves, those who are really taking strides to be welcoming for young people. Um, so I think, you know, millennials and older, I mean, we're going to learn so much just about the younger generation and how to build a better connection with them and support them and encourage them because they are our greatest asset for the future. They are the future. So it's important to know how to really guide them in the right direction. Exactly. Yeah. No, I like I do like this mindset where, you know, help support the the future, you know, maybe it's not my dream of the next of what, you know, the future is going to be like, but let's help the next generation build their dream up instead. Yes. So, I think that's a great idea. Absolutely. Yeah. And you know, so how can people um, sign up, register for this event? What do they need to do? So, we are leaving registration open a little bit longer. Uh, they can go out to our website topekapartnership.com and just search on the events page. You can register there. It's low cost. It's $10 for educators, $25 for anyone else. And again, it's great for anyone who touches the lives of young people. Um, so yeah, go out and register. Um, and and what's the time of the event? I was always the 25th. Oh, it, it's on Thursday okay. at Topeka West mm -hmm. Auditorium starting at 9 a.m. We'll have the keynote pretty much all morning followed by a Q&A. Um, lunch is provided for those who register and then in the afternoon we'll have the panel discussions and we plan to end around 2.30 or 3 o'clock. Wonderful, okay. Yes. So, no, sounds like an, a, a fun educational morning right there. Yeah. I think it's going to yeah, be great. Be. I'm excited to learn more about this. I might have to try to sneak away from the show and, and yeah. see what's going on with Gen Z. I got <laughs> I got to figure out what's all, what's going on in the future. Yes. Well, Trina, thank you so much for joining us this morning. It's been a pleasure chatting with you. Thank you. Of course, everybody, uh, to learn more, you can also visit go to pika.com.